Good morning, Vietnam. <laughs> Today we are doing what? Getting the cannas down to Canna Crossing. The cannas down to Canna Crossing. So she's got Bumblebee here, trailer, and all of these are going to Canna Crossing and to be planted. Today? No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. I'm putting my foot down. Okay, guys, you heard it here. I was overruled. They're going out today. So stay tuned. Watch. This is this video will, will call The Planting. Sound good? Sounds like a horror movie, but okay. The Planting, guys. Here we go. We're going to put them all out. Stay tuned. So obviously, it's going to be a little slow process because Bumblebee has limited capacity. Right, let's see how many are just in one like this. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So you're looking at 45, 50 there, right off the bat in a little bit. And of course. What's that? It's going to take a few trips. Yeah, I don't think we'll be able to do it in one trip, guys. Okay, I got the Green Hornet, and I had to make a pit stop uh, to get some compost. Ellie needs compost for these cannas, so I'm going to be doing that. Bring some out to her, and then I will help her bring some cannas from the greenhouse. Okay, for those of you that don't remember, this is Canna Crossing. All this, and there's a, a row right here. So we're going to start that, and we've got some soil. Nellie's up there getting some more plants, so I should go and help her. Be back in a bit. So oh, we're slowly bringing them. Hey. Lots of work. Lots of work. A lot of trips. Yes. But it will should be done today. It'll look nice. Yay. Okay, this is going to be a long, long process. As you can see, we really haven't got that much done. It's hot and it's quite a bit of work. Oh, you, you have a trick. <laughs> you never told me you were using tricks. You know. Okay, well, hmm. Well, that's a little unfair. Nellie's already mastered it. Look at the roots on those. Huh? So they, oh yeah. So they're really together. You're not pulling those apart. <laughs> no. And they had nowhere to go. They were just, ugh. They really needed being planted, eh? Okay, so I'm back to getting more cannas. There's Nelly plants. Okay, just giving you a quick update. You can see that we've gotten probably three quarters of them out, a little bit in the Green Hornet. And we've got a little bit more, so we're gonna keep plugging away. Nelly wants this gone today, even like the greenhouse down. So we've got some work and I think it's like still eight o'clock in the morning we've been uh she gets up very early to do this gardening so and drags me along with it. it's not fair anyway i'm here deal with it rusty okay an update nelly's digging so we got that bed done there this bed's done and we've got compost in it which is awesome sauce we still we got a little bit done in that bed all that to plant all of this to plant. We still got to bring some more hostas. Hostas, ha! Not hostas, cannas. And uh, we've got that much there. Bring more cannas for this. And the rest is there. And then a ton of compost. Compost, 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 and compost. So loads of compost. So maybe that's what I'll do. I'll bring another load of compost so I can catch up with Nelly. Because this bed's done, that one needs some compost. You can see the difference. We haven't spread it around yet. I've just kind of dumped it in there. Now we'll spread it where it needs to go. And this is just its original. Still, soil looks good, eh? That's going in. Yeah. 
it's nice and dark and got lots of nutrients but this when it rains they're gonna flourish and it's always nice to have another coat there so the soil doesn't dry out and then the roots will dry out nice shot Nelly look at the roots let's go and take a look just while we're here this is what we deal with in a pot you can see they really want it to grow okay back at you in a bit guys honey yes your face is a little red uh, it's a little warm okay sorry for the panting we've we're just it's hot it's hot and we've done a lot of work but anyway we've gotten this bed done rusty now understands why i like to start super early in the morning because it's not this hot no ridiculously early in the morning like it's it's actually should be a bylaw or something but you can't start garden work before <laughs> eight or something like that but anyhow we've gotten quite a bit done the greenhouse is almost empty i'm gonna finish it right now and have them out here but i think tomorrow morning right tomorrow see the cool thing is you can still sleep in and yeah. i can come out here at my stupid early time in the morning and finish the other two beds you heard it here first and then when you get up you can put the compost on them yeah okay yeah so what time is it right now it's like noon yeah so we've been you know yeah, it's noon. seven eight nine ten eleven twelve so we put some and hours in five hours break. yeah we took a break we went to a charity plant sale yeah the money was going to charity so we bought Cause some. Because you know I need more plants. Yeah. So, but we'll show you that later. Anyway, we're going to wrap this up for today and come back tomorrow and maybe finish it off. Right? Yes. Man, you're red. <laughs> it's the either sunburned or you have. Sweating. Yeah. Deaf. Yeah. Okay, guys, that's it for today. But it's Can of Crossings is coming together. Yeah, look at this. Someone's been rolling in the hay. I don't even know what that means. Uh, hmm. I crashed and yeah. burned. So you, you see who's actually working here and who's laying around. Oh, wow. Yeah, Rusty's on timeout again. Shit. Mm. Hate timeout. Mm. What? What? It is done. It is out. It is clean. It is vacant. This is the last load here. Going out to Canada Crossing. We have some a couple extras. Um, Nellie will find a spot for that. There's Nellie right there working on the patio garden. And I think the tent comes down today or the greenhouse. I think it does. I'm not sure. We will see. Stay tuned. Okay, I'm now finished for the day here. You can see it's all nice and level. I've gone around hands and knees and tucked them all in. So we still, and I brought out the rest of the hostas. It's hostas, why do I keep saying hostas? Cannas, oh my gosh. I think I'm getting sunstroke or something. So these need to be planted. This one is done. This bed's done and leveled off. And now this one's leveled off too. So that's where we are right now. I'm just taking the rest of the garbage, uh, i.e. plant pots, away. And we're going to take down the greenhouse. Good morning, folks. Okay, it's 30 degrees out. And while you guys were sleeping, because Nelly likes to get up early, we've now completed this. So pretty much can of crossing is done. We've got a couple extra ones over there. And this is the back stop. This was the reds were planted a few weeks ago, so we're now we're just filling them in with some nice compost. And we got one more row. Unfortunately, it's the biggest row. And it's a million degrees out. What do you think? I think maybe Mother Nature is making up for the loss of vacations this year. <laughs> yeah. Quite a bit of work here. But hey, this will be done in a in a few hours. You can see we've got to here with the compost a little bit more and then we got to plant this row and then can of crossings will be ready to grow nicely <clears throat> there is another bed back there but i don't know what we're gonna do it starts here too <laughs> you can kind of see it 
It's kind of grown in. Yeah, but it needs to be filled up and yeah. ready for something to go in. Yeah, we had sunflowers here. It was amazing. Like six foot, seven foot, eight foot sunflowers. It was a nice backdrop to the whole garden. But this year, it's getting kind of late to be planting sunflowers. It should sprout quickly, this heat. Cool. Like a, if we're going to do it, we have to do it in the next week. <laughs> you heard it here first. Okay, we'll be back to you maybe when these are planted. <sighs> Canna Crossing 2021. Holy. Done. Barely. Oh my gosh. It's uh, getting close to probably four o'clock. I'm just going to take a quick walk around. So it is done. And today's date is June, June 13th. And this is where we have them. So our July 6th and July 9th photos that we have from previous years had them about six inches. These are probably about 12 to 18 inches. So we definitely have a jump, but it was a lot of work. There were a couple of pots that um, didn't have great drainage in them that we had used. Stinky sludge. Yeah, it's nasty. It's gross. It's like fart bad. Folks, this is why drainage is important. Yes. <laughs> We had a couple accidents where, you know, it was hard in the big pots, the, you know, the three foot pots, they kind of tipped. The recycling bin. Oh yes, <laughs> where they actually snap a lot of them. You can see there, some of them are moving over, but anyhow, it's done. It feels so nice to have this done. And we have all these extra pots. I see there's a pot there, two pots there and one pot there. So four pots. So I have four planters already done and I didn't have to do any work. Oh, th these are going to be planters? Yeah. Okay, cool. Just put some compost in there? Yeah. Now, do these have drainage or are these the same ones that didn't, that were stinky? Nope. Do you see? This is very, very dry. Yeah, but... Which means this is one of the ones with drainage. There were a couple of these round pots that we hadn't drilled holes in. Ah. Uh. And those are the ones that were nasty. Are you sure it's not? None of them have holes. Look what I just, oh, sorry folks. Hey, but, that one's got super special drainage. Yeah, I think the, maybe these don't have drainage, but. Um, they do, that one broke because I dropped it. Ah. Last year when I was emptying the pots. <laughs> okay, anyhow, it's done and it looks pretty. This is how it actually looks. I'll put it on regular instead of wide angle. So this is what we see. This is what you will see right here and of course the hydrangea tree will pop up white in the center these will grow probably you know three to six feet have a beautiful red flower we enjoy them every year and then we've got the backstop which is green red flowers and then we have behind that just to shake things up just to go against the grain we have a red yes you heard it what we have a red backing. So anyway, pretty cool. Lots more work, no more gabbing. Yeah? Water time. Water <laughs> break time. Okay guys, don't forget to like and subscribe and join this channel because we've got lots of great, we're always working, aren't we? That would explain why I'm always tired. Yes, we're always <laughs> doing something. So I don't know what it is or whether you'll even like it, but we're doing something. So anyway. Like, subscribe, and we will see you in a few days.